welcome back this is rise of rome season two episode one and ladies and gentlemen we get straight into it roma versus calgary and this is our first game of the season let's get into the transfer window there hasn't been much job done or shall i say much um business done um so let's get straight into it as you can see here ladies and gentlemen we have brought in Marash Kambola. Again, that's somebody that we brought in before we was here, um, just to make you aware. And Dustin Vlahovic, ladies and gentlemen, he is somebody we brought in 47.5 million, going up to about 77, I believe it is, when we talk about add-ons. He's coming, ladies and gentlemen, somebody very, very young, someone up and coming, and he's somebody that we are trying to come in and at least try and just to soften a bit of the burden from um, Tammy Abraham, can these two play up front, ladies and gentlemen? We'll be able to see later on the season, obviously, as I did tell you all before, last season, Tammy Abraham was injured for five to six months, which was very un unfortunate for him and for us. Um, so we are going to see how that goes. So he's going to be leading the line for us today. Just to make you aware, when you look down here, ladies and gentlemen, he scored 12 goals in five games. He's doing the job so far. Let's see if he can carry on again this season. Last season, sorry, should I say, unfortunately, we wasn't able to win the league. To be honest, we never had any chance there. Inter Milan won that one. We managed to get third, which obviously is Champions League. But less talking from me. Let's get straight into it. Today, we are going to play our Tiki Taka 4-2-3-1. And I'm going to be hoping that we are going to do some job today. A few players who were off on loan, they have come back today. So we are going to play them today. So this is the team we have. We have Patricio in goal. Spinner, um, Spinner, Zola, sorry, Ibanez, Mancini, and Karsdorp. There we have Cristante and Vertut, and we have Clivert again. You know, he's the legendary son of the other Clivert. Pellegrini and Zanolio, and we have Vlahovic up front. Let's see what we're going to be able to do today. Tiki Taka 4 2 3 1, ladies and gentlemen. That's the formation we are going to play. And I'm really hoping that again, when Tammy Abraham does come back in, we be able to play these two strikers um, up front. Again, it's been very difficult to bring in players. We haven't had the money. Um, wages are a big issue. There's a lot of players here who are on big wages that we are going to be trying to move on. Um, so we have to wait and see and see if we can get some people off the um, the wage the wage bill. And then hopefully we'll be able to bring in some players. Um, but for now, unfortunately, we've only brought in one player, which is a striker. Um, so I'm hoping that that's going to do us justice, but we'll just have to wait and see. Let's get straight into the, to the dressing room. And um, we're favourites, so we should definitely go out there and act like it and obviously perform like them. So let's get straight into today's game. We are playing Calgary. We are at home. So you are expecting that we are going to be obviously favourites. So let's just see how it goes so far. We've had pre-season. Pre-season has been really good for us. Um, but again, let's just hope again that we can bring this into the first game of the season. Let's see what Vlahovic can do in his first natural start of the season. And there we go. We've got the first corner off today. Vera 2, he swings that ball into the near post. Unfortunately um, for us, it does get cleared out. But Abenas has the ball. He's taking his sweet, sweet time here. Let's see if he can find somebody else. Yes, he does play Pellegrini in his wits. Ball in Vlahovic straight into um, Kragnol's hand. And there we go. We thought that. Vlahovic would have his first goal of the game and also for Roma in the colours of the, was it orange I think it is or red orange, whatever you want to call it. Right, here we go. Spinozola on the ball, plays it into Pellegrini. Let's see. We're going to have to try and get our fullbacks into this position. Cliver on the ball into Spinozola. Can he see if he can whip that ball in? Let's see. He's got player space. He does whip that ball in. It does go straight to Veratut. So let's see what we can do. A great ball over into Kluivert. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. It's 1-0 to Roma. Justin Kluivert, he scores his first goal of the game. Comes off the woodwork and goes straight in. That was some sort of vision from Veratut. Let's have a look at that again, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. We see Spinazzoli plays a great ball over. Unfortunately for us, it does get headed in, headed out. But Veratut plays a great ball there. And he sees the run of Kluivert. Cliver does what he needs to do and heads it straight in there. And I'm very happy to have Cliver back with us. Um, he is going to be helping us there. We have Mikatarian, ladies and gentlemen, as well. Remember that. But again, maybe we might just get one more season, season of Mikatarian, get rid of his wages, and then we can bring in. We have a lot of youngsters in our side. But let's see, ladies and gentlemen, if we can really push for the league title today. I'm really hoping that this season we can make a 
a real big challenge, but it's going to be difficult. Um, there hasn't been much changes, as I said before, but uh, hopefully um, bringing in Vlahovic um, um, has, has done some good justice for us in that attacking position, right? Calgary are playing the ball all over. They do waste possession, and it's cars drop on the ball. Let's see what he can do. He is going to continue running. Can he play a great ball in? Yes, he does. Vlahovic headers it. And again, straight into a crag nose hands. Again, that's Vlahovic. Two opportunities there. Let's hope that, you know, the next one is going to be a goal. Here we go. Cristante on the ball. Great ball over. Vlahovic, he lays in. Zanolio. Zanolio! <laughs> Here's the bar. The post, sorry, should I say. And what great football we have at the moment here. We are trying to play football um, and just the right way. Tiki-taka football, ladies and gentlemen. And, but again, we are going to get them involved. We have the Gagan press as well. Um, so that's how we're going to be using the great headed in. Oh, Vlahovic again. So far, he could have had a hat trick so far, but it's good signs from him so far early on. 11 minutes have gone. We've had five shots, three on target. And let's just see what we can do again. As we are playing the gay game press, the boys have to be fit. It's very, very important for us to play this formation. The boys have to be fit. And I think so far in 16 minutes, we've done not bad. Let's see if we can just create a lot more chances and actually be a bit more clinical inside that box. Because again, like we said, it's only 1-0 at the moment, but it's all been us. So great ball over. Vlahovic manages to skip past one, but he does get knocked out. But now we have Zanolio on the ball now. Let's see what is he going to do. He skipped past... Karlsdorp has the ball, plays it into Kluivert. There we have second goal of the season, second goal of the game. Justin Kluivert, he's knocking on the door. He wants to be a part of this team. And what a great goal so far. Kluivert has been very important um, in his alone spell. And we've looked at his attributes and see what he can do. And that's why he's playing today. Karlsdorp does what he needs to do. Great ball. And against a beautiful volley by Kluivert into the bottom right corner. And ladies and gentlemen, it is 2-0 to Roma. Now, let's see. Can we really, really push, 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 push and try and win the league this season? It is going to be a big ask, but I think every season we can do something to at least challenge and progress and improve this team. Oh, how that did not go in, ladies and gentlemen. Mancini with the header. Again, we have to try and keep these players. It's very, very important we try and keep these players as there's a lot of top clubs coming in for them. If they do want to go, unfortunately, there's nothing we can do. We're going to have to try and bring in um, adequate recover or replacements. And yeah, we can deal with that money. But again, I'm not going to be held, held um, ransom. If anybody wants our players, be prepared to play the big money. Right, Clive on the right-hand side. Let's see if he can whip that ball in. He does get tackled and we've got a corner here. If they are going to show the corner, let's hit that near post. We have Ibanez, we have Mancini, who's very, very dangerous in the in the box. Right, Pellegrini whips the ball in. Vlahovic, again, saves. Could be a hat-trick. Ladies and gentlemen, Vlahovic is playing a very, very good game. Can you imagine here, ladies and gentlemen, having Vlahovic and Tammy Abraham up front? I really feel like they're going to complement each other. Um, I just really cannot wait until we have these boys available. We are going to play a 4-2-4. We probably play a wing play as well. Get the full backs, get the um, wingers involved as well and really, really push out that wings and get those ball into the box. I think it's going to be a great season. I just got this feeling, ladies and gentlemen. Right, very two to near post. Ibanas does get headed out. Pellegrini now. He's got plenty of space here to take the shot. Let's see. Well, a lot of ricochets here. Vlahovic may have just got his first goal for his new club, Roma. They seem to be calling for, I'm not sure, offside or a foul. But I think we are going to get that goal. Let's have another look. It does get headed out. Pellegrini has the ball. Oh, he's onside. Surely they they are going to give us that. He's onside. He has to be onside. There we go. Vlahovic, what he deserves. He deserves that goal. 29 minutes have gone. We are 3-0 up. What a way to start the game. Start the season. We're letting everybody know in the league. We are here to stay. We are here to win. Again, Juventus are losing 2-0. Atalanta are winning 2-0. Juventus, I'm not sure what's going on with them. They've really dropped. Right, now let's see how we defend as a team. We have Calgary. We have um, Jabolo, I think it is, on the ball. But we managed to steal that ball. Pellegrini, 
keeps on going. Can he find somebody? Let's see. Plays a great ball over. Vlahovic, can he get his second goal of the game? Yes, he does. Dustin Vlahovic, ladies and gentlemen. That's why we spend the money for him. Two goals for him. 4-0 to us. Great goal. That's exactly what we want to see him doing. This is what we brought him in for. He didn't really score that much goals. I think he was probably the third or fourth best of um, the goal tally for the league. Um, but this is exactly what we want. And again, ladies and gentlemen, I have said it and I cannot stress it enough. I actually cannot wait until we have him and Tammy Abraham playing up front because I really think we're gonna they're going to compliment us. We don't really need that number 10 personally for me. Um, so again, we can drop and we can have Veritut and um, Pellegrini or even Cristante and Pellegrini as that centre midfield. Let them dictate, get that ball up. And then we've got the rest of the wingers and everything else to do. I think we definitely need a left back. Um, Spina, um, uh, Spinazzola is not somebody that ideally we're looking to keep. Um, again, he's on a lot of wages. He is injury prone, so we have to wait and see. But we go into halftime, ladies and gentlemen. I am very, very happy. I cannot believe that this is how we've started the season so far. Long may it continue. Right, what we're going to do now, I'm just going to change um, our tactics. I'm going to go to a 4-2-3-1 tiki-taka just to calm us down a bit, not waste so much energy, and let's just continue playing our passing football. Right, let's see. Is a ball into Calgary. Gets headed over Simeone. Oh, how lucky are they? And, you know, how bad defending was we? Um, a ball over the top by a header as well. Um, it's not really good here. Um, but again, let's see what we can do. We are in the driving seat. We are 4 0 up. But again, let's keep a clean sheet. That's something that we definitely need to be looking to do. Um, keep clean sheets. If we keep clean sheets, we will and, and score a lot of goals, we will win a lot of games. Again, our problem is now is how we're going finish, to finish off games where we are playing the mid table teams and also as well giving a big, big um, performance against the bigger sides. Again, i.e. into Milan, They've, we've struggled against them a bit. Hoping we could be a bit more better there defensively and everything else. But let's see what we've got. Cardona are on the ball. There we go. I'm not sure who that is, but yep, he plays a long ball over. Um, Simeon, again, very, very lucky Simeon. He's had a lot of the ball. Um, I'll probably leave it. I probably am going to leave it. At this present moment, present moment, Vlahovic is a little bit tired. I think we're going to leave him for a little bit and maybe we may change things up a bit. Um, but at the moment, we're 4-0 up. So, you know, we can relax and cruise and just finish off this game. That's exactly what we want to do. Um, clean sheet, very important. Defenders deserve it, I believe. Um, but we do need to be very careful because Calgary are um, kind of slightly pushing us a bit. Um, so let's see exactly what we can do. Um, we're going to make just a slight change into the instructions. Just looking at um, the Calgary team, you can see that their full backs are not having the best of games. So why not exploit it, ladies and gentlemen? Why not exploit it? Let's see if we can do that. They've got um, their wing back on 5.7. They've got Nandez on 6.2. So why not? Let's push. Let's push. Let's push it in there. Let's 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 get them. Let's get it going. Let's put the pressure on the fullbacks on the defense as well. Right, ladies and gentlemen, it's getting to that time, 60th minute. We are going to make a change, and Vlahovic is going to come off just to have a bit of a rest here, ladies and gentlemen. And we're going to put on Shomadov. Um, he is going to come on. Can we stand an ovation for Vlahovic? Vlahovic comes off with his two goals, and ladies and gentlemen, he deserves the praise. He deserves the applause from the fan and the manager he's had a really good um first debuting game right where else can we make some sort of changes let's put take off pellegrini um we can put on um mkhitaryan mkhitaryan can come on for the game nandez on the ball can we get a tackle in make sure they don't score a goal let's try and let's keep a clean sheet here let's see what we can do nandez is on the ball that's fine. They haven't had the best of games. Let's pressure them. All right, a long ball in. Again, Simeone is giving us a bit of troubles there. He just comes in, then heads it just over the bar. Again, Cliver, Cliver can come off. Um, we can put on Providence. He is our youngster, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to 
bring him in to have a bit of game time here and let's just see what he can do he is a youngster was on loan again so we're going to give these players chances to come up and try and stick their position in the team right let's have another look and see can we make any other changes very toot takes the free kicks bends it over just over the crossbar very very unlucky here um just having a look to see if we can make maybe any other changes um, Mancini is a bit tired. Um, even as it's not having the best of game, um, Zanolio um, is extremely tired as well. Unfortunately, we cannot make any more changes. I believe we've made three changes. I'm sure normally they have allowed us to do four changes. I'm sure of that. But anyway, um, it looks like we are going to win this game. Obviously, six minutes plus stoppage time. But the thing is, can we keep a clean sheet? I would love to keep a clean sheet if we can. I'm hoping that we will be. We have fully dominated this game, ladies and gentlemen. And again, Vlahovic doing what we know he can do, which is score goals. And hopefully, the long may that continue, ladies and gentlemen. But as we get closer, we have two minutes of stoppage time and it's going to be the end of the game. And I'm very happy for it. How to start off the season, 4-0 victory at home. That makes us very optimistic about the season so far. Right, so ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of the game. Roma, four calorie nil. We've had 22 shots, nine on target. XG of 2.43. Pass completion, 91%. And possession, 50%. So, again, a very, very good performance from the boys. Um, let's outstretch and say, well done, lads. That was a very good win for us. And long may it continue. But let's have a look at the schedule, ladies and gentlemen. And let's see when we're going to come back. And also, let's see the type of running we have so far. Don't really want to bother about that. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. Obviously, we are first probably from winning 4-0. And let's see this momentum we have. Can we continue it? Because this is what we need to do. We need to try and continue this momentum into the league. And hopefully, the next time we come back, we will still be where we are. So, ladies and gentlemen, let's have a look at the schedule and see where we're going to be left off. Where we're going to come back, should I say? Preseason, you can see here, we've scored a lot of goals um, and done really well. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're going to play a lot offline. Uh, and I think we will come back. Um, hmm. We will come back for the Juventus game, ladies and gentlemen. We'll come back in, in January and we will come back for the Juventus game. But, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see, we have a nice, decent running until we get into um, the ending of August, you know, and then you've got four or five games, which is a little bit difficult. Napoli, even though we've done the double against them, um, Inter Milan, that's going to be a very difficult game as well. But, ladies and gentlemen, that's all for today. Thank you very much for watching. I am Football Manager Maniac. Please don't forget to subscribe, like and share. Hit the thumbs up and notification bell. It does help the channel. Hit the comments below. Let me know, ladies and gentlemen, what do you think our chances of winning the league is? Do you think we can win it? Or do you think maybe we might be in and around? Also, we have Champions League as well. So we do have to try and juggle all of that together. But ladies and gentlemen, that's all for today. I will see you all next time. Thank you very much and take care.